Diabetes is a costly and often disabling chronic illness, but with proper management, people with diabetes can live rich and full lives. In 2010, researchers from Boston Medical Center and the University of Massachusetts Medical School began an experiment to engage women with uncontrolled type 2 diabetes in group self-management intervention sessions. This National Institutes of Health-funded study compared two formats for group intervention delivery, an online virtual world versus a traditional face-to-face -face format. In this video, you will see segments from two virtual world patient sessions. This video was recorded with permission from the participants. So what was, tell us about your exercise. What was your plan specifically that you wanted to do? My action plan was to exercise more and to find different ways to relieve stress. I was able to exercise more, but the relieving stress, I was pretty um, unsuccessful. <laughs> yeah. Um, you have yeah. a lot of stress in your life right now. Yeah, I have yeah. a younger sister. She's two years younger than me. She's also a type 1 diabetic, and she was really sick, and... She was yeah. in a coma in the hospital for 17 days, and it, it affects me in so many different ways. Sometimes I don't even know how to articulate it, you know. I, I was able to kind of conquer that and say this is my life and my health, and I have, I'm not only living for myself, I'm living for other people. And Tell us what your action plan is, Heather. I've already started my walk, and so now I would like to start tracking my carbs. I went to the supermarket at the weekend and I realized that if I buy like loaves of bread, I can look at the back and see how much a loaf, how much grams of carb is in mm -hmm. one loaf so I know how many to eat or. Okay, and how many days a week do you think you're going to be able to do that? For the whole week, yes, I need to really and get on track with that. And what's your confidence level that you're going to be able to do that? My confidence level is a nine. It's not the load that breaks you down, it's the way you carry it. Uh-huh. And how, what does that mean to you? It's, it's basically um, how you handle your situations. And uh, exactly. diabetes exactly. is an everyday thing, so. It is. Part Definitely. of my life. So what could be a strategy to try to cut down on eating out? With the um, eating out, like um, carrying, bringing your lunch, you know, like when I get hungry, um, with me, bring them fruit. Like an apple, mm -hmm. and it'll okay. kill that little hu that hunger munch that it catches you in the middle of the day. <laughs> right. <laughs> We're going to go to a actual restaurant where we can sit down and actually order food. Um, so that should be fun, and that will be at the end of the session. If you the see artist. a food that doesn't look particularly healthy, you can click on it and drag it over to the trash can. There goes there some goes chips, chips into the trash. <laughs> 